Sup geeks, it's Joe here and welcome back to Max Payne. Uh, I left it on a cliffhanger for you guys last time, um, when this guy got brutally murdered. And now I have to go through this door and brutally murder the people who brutally murdered him. Oh. Well, that was anticlimactic. I have to press the button and then go through the door that brutally murdered people and brutally murdered people. Oh. That was, once again, anticlimactic. Okay, right, let's uh, shotgun these guys. Ah! Oh shit, this is not gonna go my way. Oh god. Oh, tits, right. Uh, boom! In your face, well, your chest area. Oh yeah, took that guy down, slow motion. As you... Well, what a shell. Mm. This game actually has a lot of detail for a game that came out. Insert year that this game came out here. Because I still haven't found it out. I'm sorry. Okay, um... The phone's broken, so... I can't call help! Um... That's not a way... That is! I thought there'd be bad guys in here. I was wrong. There are, however, pills! Mmm! Pills. This game really does not tell a good message, does it? Right. Cutscene. <coughs> or maybe not. Maybe just wreck. Okay. Um. And this button. Let's get line two going. Doing some lines, guys. I should set my timer going as well, because I always forget that. Right, so we've been going for like a minute, two minutes now. Okay, um, let's go back, and back to the place where the things happen, and remember to press the button so you don't just look like an idiot going through the door. Oh, that's a, that's a train. Okay, um, this is line four. It's line two I'm going to, I believe. That's line five. Line two! This way! Line two! This way! Maintenance! Line two! This way! Two trains! I like trains. The train lit up like a Christmas tree. The power was back on. Wait, so if that train's lit up like a Christmas tree, and that's the way, and I know that's the way because it's the way, then what's this way? Oh, I remember. There's things this way, and then you get to a dead end. And I'm gonna go this way, because loot and enemy killing is always the best thing. Actually, no. I'll just loot these... These... Um, these ammos, and then go, because that's just a place that's full of enemies. And I don't like it. It's not my happy place, to be honest. It really isn't. Okay, um... Onwards and this way, woods. Mmm. Buttons. They open doors. Yes, they do. Oh, Jesus. It opens at the front. Okay, that's good to know. Inspection car. <clears throat> Max, you're not inspecting anything. I know this because... Oh my god, you're gonna crash it. So much for being subtle. Right. Yeah. So much for that subtlety thing that he was talking about. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Right. Um. No. That was an utter failure. Oh my god. That's a lot of enemies. I think I was maybe supposed to kill a few of them through that door, but. Ah. Uh, I can just use my amazing slow motion powers to murder the shit out of all of them. Or I could have just shot those explosive things that would have just murdered the shit out of all of them for me without me using my explosion-y... Well, not explosion-y. Slow motion-y powers. <coughs> Let's take some pills and save. Because that could have gone very wrong and I would have been sent way, way back. And then I would have had to cut things and I don't like cutting things. Because it requires effort in post-production. Oh, hey! Chapter 2, live from the crime scene! The rusty door led to an abandoned part of the station, closed off since the early 40s. 
Something big was going down in Roscoe Street. Maybe that's why Alex had wanted to meet me here. Maybe not. One way or the other, I was gonna find out. One way or the other, I was gonna find out. Max Payne. He always does things the painful way. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, tits. Oh, that was a Desert Eagle and not the dual Berettas that I wanted. Oh, maybe that's why I'm... Let's save again. What the? Oh, God. Uh, dual Berettas. Oh, my bay. Oh, go. Oh. That's right. Run away from me while I embed my head into this wall. Oh, God. Fucking cowardly shit. Oh. Oh, you're a prick. What a prick. Ah, uh, slow motion powers are the best kind of powers. Right. Let's get this right this time and use a shotgun like he's using. You little shit. Fucking run away from me, why don't you? That's right. That is right, sir. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop gloating so much because it's probably gonna get me killed. Let's save again. <clears throat> this way! Oh, what's in this water? Probably Ebola! Mmm! Topical! Mmm! Though not for this time period. Slow motion! Shooty thing! Oh, yeah! Get wrecked, man! Oh! No, you're hiding behind boxes! That's not fair. I'm gonna get you. Yeah. I got you. I'm gonna hit these things with... Oh, the baseball bat that I don't have. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, let's face it. I did collect that baseball bat three years ago. So, uh, if I still had it, then it'd be a bit weird. Okay. So, lead pipe. Um. Dual Berettas. Mm, they're Berettas. And they like to jewel. Let's save the game. <clears throat> what the hell was that? An explosion, Max. An explosion. Do you not know what they are? Because it was quite obviously an explosion. God, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? Oh, yeah. That's how we do things in... Um... The door had been welded shut ages ago and the bomb was missing a detonator. Yeah, okay. <coughs> right. Let's quickly save and switch back to my Berettas because the sword off shotgun is bullshit. Use some more pills because Max can never have too many pills. Let's save just before this bit because I remember getting killed a lot here. <coughs> yep, still got that cold. Yeah, for the reference, I'm recording this pretty much straight after the last episode, so if I didn't still have the cold, it'd be quite miraculous, to be honest. There we go. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, um, I have literally no dual Beretta ammo. Right, pump action shotgun for you. That didn't go well for you. Oh, no, neither did that. For you. For you! For fuck's sake! Pills! Save! Collect ammo! Mm, juicy goodness! Beretta! Jewel! Door? There we go! Oh! Oh! You! And then... You! And then... You, I guess. Although not very well. Ah, uh, ow. See, this is why you save, guys. This is why you save, like, a lot. Because, man, old games really just didn't like it when you didn't save. Right, 26. That's not going to be enough, is it? Let's Desert Eagle this. And slow motion again. Take these pills. Ow. Ow, you motherfucker! I'm going to need all the concentration I can get, aren't I? And, and you, and you, please, please. Oh, I, I have pills! Yeah! That's how you fight your battles. 
with slow motion and you end up limping. If you don't end up limping, then it wasn't a fun battle. And you know, there's loads of painkillers here anyway. Let's have a look at this phone. We're coming <coughs> out from the crime scene. Who is this? Right back at you. This is Deputy Chief Jim Bravora from the NYPD. You are to cease your criminal activities and surrender immediately. Sure thing, Jim. Me and the boys have been talking and everyone's real sorry. They'll never do it again. Who the hell is this? Being placed at the scene of a bank robbery wouldn't have tipped the odds in my favor. No, it would not, Max. No, it would not. Okay, um... Um... Let's open this place. Vault C! Mm. The bank robbers scored Suddenly laying the I table. see! Um. The bank robbers have been after Acer Corporation bonds. Ooh, the Acer bonds. success story had recently been on every channel and on the cover of every magazine. I don't know what bonds are, really, to be honest. Do we have them in Britain? Am I sounding very, very dumb here? I bet everyone who knows things is really, really kind of just looking like, oh my god, he's retarded, isn't he? He was, he, oh. No, that's insensitive, I won't say that. No, retarded is insensitive. Um, he's really, really slow and dumb. That's probably also insensitive. I'm gonna stop now. Um. The bank robbers had left their tools on the table. Judging like by the detonators, detonator. explosives to send yeah. Liberty into orbit. Detonators are cool because, um, you know, you detonate them and shit. Right, uh, let's save. And jump over here. I said jump over here. Right, good. Um, then press this button again. Mm, button pressing. <clears throat> Shotgun ammo! <coughs> oh. I do not feel good. Right. There's gonna be enemies, isn't there? Or not. I remember now. They're not here. They're here! Yeah! <laughs> Good thing I was right that time. Otherwise, I look would have looked pretty dumb. And you have a grenade. That's not good practice. Grenades are not good practice. Did he actually throw that thing? Shit, run. No, he did not. Okay, um, we're good. We're good. Let's... Fuck! Detonator! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Cutscene, slow motion. <coughs> cool beans. Oh, I see medicine there. You guys see medicine? Hold it, Max. Jesus, you almost gave me a heart attack. I nearly shot you. Alex, I'm right glad to see you. What the hell's going on? There are more corpses here than at the city morgue. It's an armed robbery. Tunnel job straight through the Roscoe Bank vault through the old station. This is Lupino's game. This is Lupino's doing? Lupino's men? Really? You sure you know how to take a place? Can you throw? No, it's locked. We gotta get out of here. If it's Lupino, it's... Alex? Alex! There was nothing I could do. He was dead. I could tell by the empty accusing stare of his eyes. You know, and the shit ton of blood and the fact that he was shot in the head might also give you a clue. Although, let's face it, you know, people have been shot in the head and survived. It does happen very, very, very occasionally. And not to people in video games, really. Well, unless, you know, they're the main character. <clears throat> in Call of Duty. Right, let's go and pill up. Oh, oh so good. Have you seen this missing person? No, I have not. If I have, then um, they're probably dead and not any longer missing. So, you know, I guess that might give you some closure. Tits I really should have saved, shouldn't I? Ow. Man. I really should have saved. Like, a lot. And we're back to where we were. Oh, that's a grenade. That's not gonna do me any favors. Okay. Shoot the men. 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 Oh, I got shot by the men. Oh, come on. Come on. That's right. Oh, get shot. And you. And you. And you. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm. 
Well, that's not really what I was talking about. I was actually talking about just shooting them, not, like, getting them slow motion shot. Right, um... Yeah, so... We just learned the benefits of saving. Um... Open! Sesame. It's the same? I don't know. <clears throat> I know how sesame is uh, pronounced, by the way, guys. I was, um... I was just, uh... I don't know what I was doing. Shh, I'm tired. I was up late last night, and by late, I mean not late at all. Um, where the fuck do I go? Open. Well then why, why did it close when I pressed it before? Huh? Right, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, um, going out into the unknown. Oh my god. Alex had kept me relatively sane for the past three years. Now I didn't know how I felt. Somehow he had stumbled upon something big and ended up stepping on Jack Lupino's toes. Pino ran his racket of sex, drugs, and contract killings from a sleazy hotel in a slum block of tenements. The NYPD was closing in. I could hear the sirens. Their wail was a crescendo. Lupino thought he could get us by taking Alex out and leaving me to take the fall for it. All he had gotten was my attention. I went for the hotel first. It was a sad old thing with flickering lamps and faded colors, cheap mobster punks and tired-eyed prostitutes. I walked straight in, playing at Bogart, like I'd done a hundred times before. The place was run by a couple of murdering mobsters with shark smiles. The Finito Brothers. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the pain in the butt. Pain to the max. You're killing me. If you make that up yourselves, you get some wine out downstairs to come up with it. Don't answer that. A rhetorical question. I got something for the boss. Lupino around? That kind of depends on who's asking. A friend or a junk swap plan? The don't answer. It's where I'm, uh, how do you put it, uh, rhetorical questions. Lupino ain't here, but he says bye. Lupino wasn't in his cheap hotel. Instead, I ran into the Finito brothers. My cover had been blown. The door slammed shut behind me. And then I was dodging bullets like raindrops. Oh shit. Right. Oh god, it's about to go down. Uh, I will see you guys next time on Max Payne.